little valve opens when that chain is pulled. That's what blows the horn. Hi guys, it's Mr. Good Pliers. I am out at a friend's yard today and we're going to be checking out a 1959 Diamond T 923C, also called the China Closet. These trucks were designed to be very light, so the cab is actually made of aluminum and the front bumper is aluminum. The roof skin is fiberglass. Yet still, there's a lot of truck here, and they weighed 14,000 pounds. So this one is a 1959. This body style was started around 1955, 1956, somewhere in there. And these trucks were used for day cab, but if you wanted to sleep in them, there is the sleeper on the back. And she's got a six cylinder diesel engine in line. No turbo, no supercharger. The big fifth wheel plate in the back. Air brakes, front and rear. Big old diesel tank with a step. Check that out, Armstrong Heatmaster tires. Relic of their time. Engine with the yellow paint I'm guessing is a cat, but I'm not sure. the extended sleeper compartment on the back. Check out the master brake cylinder on the outside of the truck. She's lost her diamond T badge unfortunately. Old, old bumper there been repaired. A great old over the road truck. Come inside and we'll take a look in the cab. Pretty, pretty Spartan accommodations in the old workhorse. Got that diamond T steering wheel button, diamond T custom built. Got the panel of gauges. Got your tack. Speedometer of 80 miles an hour, a little optimistic. Check out that engine oil temperature gauge. Kind of neat Art Deco decals, details all around it. There's the Bendix Westinghouse brake lever. Check out that old Art Deco design. Got the old Art Deco ashtray with the sliding top. Not wanting to slide anymore though. This was the view inside the cab, looking down the road. Neat little Art Deco dome light. Now this truck has had the critters in it. You can see a fan there. The mud wasps have built quite the nest across the blades. 
passenger seat there. Here in the back is the sleeper. Take a look at that fiberglass roof panel. One of the neat features of this track is this little low air warning signal. It's kind of like a like a semaphore style. Close it back up. Took a real man to drive one of these. One of the great, great relics of early over the road trucking. Just something that pretty uncommon and I wanted to show you today. If you like this and you wanna see more vehicles, go ahead and throw a like on the video and subscribe and we'll see you on the next one. This one was used probably to haul dozers and excavators and things of that nature. She's a 923C.